in on those two areas. Did it perfectly in executing his game plan. And now what type of plan does he script up against Sadulayev? He has some of the best hips in wrestling. If you're going to attack him, you need to get him off the ground because when he sprawls, he's going to get go-behinds. Sajulayev, as we know, gets fast to the outside and comes up a very tall with his attacks. His motion, his push, his pull, his snap, his pass, he clears weapons as well as anybody in the world, if not the best in the world. Open the fingers. There's a lot of talk about the trilogy, Chapter 3, Sajulayev and Snyder. Well, it's a different type of trilogy tonight. These two have met three times, including tonight's matchup. Very recently in the semis, the Olympic Games back in 2016, and then the finals of the European Championship most recently in 2018. Both those matches, by the way, won by Sajulayev. He won two to one in the finals of the European Championship, an eight one win for Russia in the semis of the Rio Games. Both of them getting up from 90, uh, up from 86 to 97, growing into the weight. Sajulayev in 2017 in Paris was just coming up to 97. He still wasn't fully grown into the weight. Now he's a, I wouldn't say a huge 97, but he's a big 97 kilo wrestler. We'll get our first whistle. Passivity, Azerbaijan, he goes up on the shot clock. And Sajalayev's smart. He's not gonna attack straight on into the hips. He's gonna allow Sharifov to come to him. Nice snap by Sajalayev, good motion. Beautiful attack by Sharifov coming quickly off of his knee. Neither of these athletes spin are, are going to spend too much time on their knee. Sharifov on the clock after his second passivity warning. Five seconds to go. We're going to see the first point on the board for Abdul Rashid Sajulayev. So Sajulayev strikes the passivity point, a 1 0 lead. Inside a minute to go in this opening period. Official asking for contact. He seemed to be wrestling from the outside. I think everyone in the cr in the crowd wants to see these two scrap a little bit and make some attacks. Telling Sharif off to keep that head up. Head up usually means offensive wrestling. So you know, a verbal warning to Sajulayev. Wanting some more action. It's been a pretty slow paced opening period. Sajulayev with a 1 0 lead. Does this pace favor Azerbaijan, Brian? It does. Because if he can keep it close, one hold can make a big deal, like he did against Snyder. Here is Sajulayev with a shot off the whistle into a sit out position. No points yet. There's two for Sajulayev. The champion scores unanswered points toward the end. And that's the one thing that he does really well. If he gets to a leg, he's going to get two. His motion, he cracked Sharifov down. He didn't allow Sharifov to whizzer and get his hips up. And he was able to plant and keep his right hip on the ground while he came around for two. That's why he is so good, because he's opportunistic and he scores when he needs to score. At the end of the period, that can make pay dividends towards the end of the match, just pay, just scoring at the, uh, the end of a period. I was on the plane with our official, he's from Puerto Rico, and I saw him before this match and he was so excited to be doing the last match of the evening. Pacing a little bit, as a matter of fact, because this is a big stage. First thing he said to both wrestlers as they arrive back at the center mat, more action, please. Sharifov down, here's Sajulayev on a shot. Sharifov trying to bury that head, put the pressure on those hips, trying to come up with that grip. Sajulayev still digging in on that right leg of Sharifov. And this is where Sharifov Tends to score, he's on these go-behind, dropping his hip. Sajulayev has vices on that leg yeah. as he's able just to hold and pull it in. Hey, 
Nice snap by Sajalayev, pushing and pulling and moving Sharif off to where he wants him to. He doesn't take bad shots. He takes shots when he needs to take them. And one step out. Sharif off tried to hop skip his way back. Out of danger, could not. Stepped out of bounds, a step out, 4-0. Sajulayev slowly pulling away. That late takedown, closing seconds of the first period, big. Notice Sharifov's right leg forward, and he's really pushing the action, pushing forward, keeping his right elbow down as he pushes, and then comes right for the hard snap moving Sajulayev out of position. Sajulayev, his out of position is maybe just eighth of a second before he can move his feet getting back in. Action red, action blue, Spencer. A little stalemate verbal warning there, not a true verbal warning to go to the shot clock, to go to that activity period. And if Sharifov wants to win this match, he's gonna have to attack. Now, that's easier said than done, trying to beat the weapons of Sajalayev in his hands and his elbows and his head. Very difficult, but he hasn't made a whole lot of attempts. And as we know, Abdul Rashid Sajalayev is not going to make a mistake. Up four to zero. That might as well be nine to zero with two seconds to go. It has been an incredible week for Russia at the World Wrestling Championships. They win the Greco-Roman. The women play second in freestyle. The men blowing out the field, hoping to crown another gold medal winner, and it's their team leader. Referred to around the globe as the Russian tank. The best wrestler on the planet. Tosses the shutout tonight. A 4 0 business like, workman like gold medal performance against Azerbaijan. As you hear Jason Bryant say, Champion Mira. We've heard that a lot. World champion out of Russia this week. Very humble. Missed some time early in 2019, recovering from an injury.